Hey guys, how's it going? I've just uploaded all the podcast episodes uh, that previously I was saying go to richardpedia.com. They're now at flippingwebsites.co slash podcast. And this video is about the Yoast SEO plugin because it's been giving people a lot of problems in terms of sitemaps. And I'll get to that in one second. Uh, but first of all, first thing I did was make sure that there was not going to be any duplicate content issues because the same content is currently at richardpedia.com slash the last episode with Ryan at Digital Acquisitions, slash digital dash acquisitions, and the same thing on flipping websites. So in order to fix that, the first thing you do is, or the only thing for this, is to go to the Yoast box and click on the cog, and there's a little canonical URL, and you put in the one that you want to be indexed. And going forward, uh, all new podcast episodes, I want indexed to flippingwebsites.co. So... Um, if I also upload them at richardpater.com, I will do this in reverse. Now, sitemaps. Uh, this is a new WordPress installation. I haven't done anything with um, changing any, any settings in sitemaps in Yoast. So if we go and click on and see the sitemap, this is what you get by default. Ignore this lead pages one. This is because I have a lead pages plugin. But you get posts, pages, categories, posts, uh, tags, and also author. So what I want to do is I only want the least number of pages and sitemaps um, showing because I want the least number of pages in the Google index. I don't want author archives, um, category archives, anything to show in the index. So in order to do that, you go to search appearance. And first thing is content types. You want your post to show. You want your pages to show. You want to turn off anything that you don't want to show, like pop-ups. I don't want them showing. If you go to taxonomies, this is where you can turn off the category sitemap and the tag sitemap, and these will not, will not show in the Google index. If we update the, update the sitemap, we can see that. Those have gone. I now need to get rid of the author sitemap. If you go to archives, disable the author archives, hit save, and we'll be down to the ones that we want. So that's now disappeared. That's great. The big problem that people were having with the Yoast plugin was there was a bug that set this media attachment um, redirect to no. So every image that you upload to WordPress has its own URL, but you want the URL to redirect to the to the page. You don't. What you don't want is all your media showing in search results. So people who say had a hundred pages indexed one day could wake up the next day to find there's a thousand pages in the Google index, um, 900 thin content pages, predominantly just uh, images. And as you can imagine, only having 10% of the pages in the Google index um, actually doing anything useful for users is gonna have a negative effect on your sites. And I was negatively um, affected by that. So what you wanna make sure is that this is set to yes. If not, um, you want to make you want to go to your sitemap URL. If you're using Yoast, the uh, the URL structure is always the same. So just put your site in here, and look to see if there is an attachment sitemap. Um, if there is, for me that's a problem. Um, in theory, sometimes that's not uh, actually in search results if it appears. But I I I've gone through all my sites and I've got rid of it now, and. Um, the annoying thing is, if I were to save this now, and this is saved, uh, has the bug um, actually set it up and affected people's sites, if I update this, it doesn't appear. However, on sites that it has appeared on, if I then go to yes and save, it, it actually does disappear. So it's still a bit of an issue. <laughs> um, but as long as you don't have attachment sitemap uh, in your XML sitemap, um, then you're not going to run into this problem. But that was the big issue that people were having. All their images were being indexed. So you want to make sure that you have the least number of pages indexed. Everything indexed um, should be indexed. It is of value to users. Otherwise, you, sh you should start either uh, deleting pages or no indexing pages. Um, and then throw uh, submit that sitemap into Google Webmasters and... Uh, you will be set up well for the future. Hope that was useful. Let me know. And if so, I'll make some more of these videos. Cheers, guys.